My name is Dorian Howie. It's 25 October and I want to present the weather for today in my country. In the east part of our country there will be minus one degree in Rzeszów. In, this, in our capital, in Warsaw, there will be minus one degrees. And in the north part of Poland, in Suwałki, there will be minus one degree. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Okay, Miss Magda, you get the job. Tomorrow you will have a training day. Your salary is $100. You start tomorrow. Okay, boss, thank you very much. I think I will see you again. Um, hi, can I help you with something? Take these files. Try day two? No, no, I'm here from 10 years. And you're doing the same thing for 10 years? Yeah. So, this is the first day? Yes, for you? I'm quite nervous. So, is it hard work coming here? Yeah, it's uh, difficult a little bit. Oh, I'm very sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. But we don't have uh, a little of uh, good okay. thing here, so nothing sorry. important. Could you please move that box upstairs? Okay. okay. Can you help your No, you are strong enough. Oh. Yeah, we will help. Oh, oh I have here. He takes two hundred dollars as a salary. I can understand. He can't even move a box. That's so unfair. I only have one hundred. <laughs> I'm sorry for underappreciating you, Miss Magda. I can offer you $150 now if you stay. I don't want your job anymore. Why? I'm the supervisor at this company. I'm your boss now. You're disrespecting women in work, so I'm firing you. My name is Laura. Manus one in south, Manus one in center, and Manus one in north. Goodbye and have a nice day. Wonderful. That one was great. Fred, go to market and bring some vegetables and the fruit. Don't forget the diapers. I already did this, this last time. Uh... What did you say? Oh, I'm sorry, I will go. Don't forget to take the rubbish in your way. Yes. Mom, why do you talk to daddy like this? That's not your business. Go to your room and study. Okay, mom. Go. You should return to the shop. Oh, my dear. Please, sorry. I... Go away. Dear? Yes? Why did you not take me to travel like my neighbor's wife? Because we, are, we have no money. You spend it for... Uh... You take another job. You sleep all the night. Oh, okay. I will try, my dear. Not try, you must do it. Mom, can you help me with homework? I am busy. Go to your father. Okay. Dad, can you help me with homework? No, I have enough of this. You, you watch TV all the time, you spend all our money and you don't even take care of our children. I'm leaving, I want to divorce. No, Dad, stop. You have me and my okay, mom. Okay, okay. Keep the car and send me the money each month. Do if you want.
I hope that I have explained what you are asking about. Today I want to say about a very important thing. In my government we need more women, we need strength that women possess. And I will try to involve more and more women into our policy. Now I'm going to introduce you my new advisors. Alex Henderson, Joe Doe, and Christian Snow. Mr. Ma Prime Minister, I have a question, please. Yeah, please. Sir, you say you should involve women in uh, our society, but all what I see that you choose men. So why you don't do what you say? Madame Luisa, I have many women in administration of my par party. Uh, we have a lot of cleaning ladies, secretaries, so I don't know why you are accusing me of not involving women into my policy. What is your defined for equality if you, you, just, uh, you just say that you involve women in secretary section? You know, we have good economy in our country. In my term of office, industry has grown by 10%. That's in economy. But can I ask you how many women you have in your government, sir? That's a good question. I have nothing to say. Thank you.